Hello, my name is Kevin Morgan. I'm the Chief Marketing Officer at Clearfield. No matter where you look, 2022 will be a banner year for fiber deployments. And I see three specific trends shaping up for 2022. The first trend is that carriers will find a way to double their rate of homes passed in 2022. Deployment speed will be key in hitting the metric of homes passed since every service provider will be measured on that. Success will actually affect their Wall Street valuations. And so many of these companies will streamline the process of fiber connection and take advantage of the latest techniques to increase the rate of installations. The second trend I see for 2022 is that 2022 will be the year that we see some of the larger cable MSOs move to all fiber networks as some are already messaging for defensive purposes. Cable MSO fiber deployment in 2021 was up by more than 50% driven by the smaller tier two, tier three carriers. Two years ago, many of these carriers made the decision to migrate to all fiber networks and fiber to the home was able to eliminate the node splits. The smaller the MSO network, the more likely the switch. But in 2022, we will see the big companies jump on board. Finally, trend number three is that 2022 will see 5G move beyond enhanced mobile broadband and get into massive machine to machine and industrial IoT applications. In addition, ORAN is gaining momentum, displacing proprietary hardware and joining the growth of disaggregated open source networks built using software defined networks or SDN and NFV. Both factors will drive more fiber as the continued expansion of 5G services across the nation move from urban dense areas into other markets. In these trends, and if these trends continue, 2022 will be a banner year for fiber deployment.